It began, as always, with the desire for power. The need to conquer. The hunger to consume. Inevitably, this led to conflict. Humanity fought an endless battle against itself, until it was forced to unite against a power far greater than it had ever known. But even united, humanity left only destruction in its wake. Despite their best efforts at survival, the humans of Sierra continued to march blindly to their imminent doom. Unaware that their misguided attempts at retaliation were only leading them ever closer to extinction. They had thought us crippled by their weapons of mass destruction. But to survive is to endure and prosper. And we have most certainly survived. Jacinto now stands as the last bastion of humanity. A final, desperate defense in the face of impossible odds. In a way, I pity them. But humanity, as always, brought this war upon itself. They're getting bolder. Those gears were guarding Pomeroy Depot. Damn, that's just down the road. Exactly. They're moving deeper every day. At least we got reinforcements. Yeah, but for how much longer? Okay, I'm heading to the hospital now. I need to check on that lead. Thanks, Anya. I... Good luck, all right? Sergeant Phoenix! Are you Sergeant Phoenix? Delta Squad? <gasps> I'm your new trainee. And green as grass by the looks of it. Time to train the Rook? Yeah, lucky me. Go easy on the kid, okay? Private Ben Carmine, sir! Reporting for duty, sir! Drop the sir shit, kid. We're not that polite out here. Come on, let's go. Oh, yeah. Welcome to Delta. It's an honor to serve with you, sir. I hear that you're Sergeant. the one who... Sergeant. Yes, sir. Uh, Sergeant Phoenix. Must be good to know you're fighting with a Pendulum War hero. He's just Marcus to me, man. Name's Dom, by the way. Good to meet you, sir. Uh, Dom, you see action in the war, too? Rook, we can talk history later. Concentrate on your training now. I don't need you getting religious out there. Pardon? Holy? Oh, right. Full of holes. Got it. First things first, Rook. Stay focused on your mission. Best way is to check your TACCOM before the bullets fly. Mine says teach the Rook the Golden Rule. Oh, uh, I know. Do unto others as you would have... Not out here, kid. Golden Rule of the Gears is take cover or die. You know how to get into cover, Rook? Show me. Okay. Keep your head down, eyes open. Check your surroundings. Always keep your head down like that in a firefight. You'll be fine. Okay, people, let's move out. Yo, you said your name is Carmine? You got a brother was a gear? Yeah, all four of us. Well, 
three now. You know one of them? Check this shot. Nice one. I'll call that and raise you five. Helps if you aim, Marcus. Maybe help your odds of winning. You could hit those in your sleep with the rifle. Come on, use your pistol, man. Better reload. Could be some more killer bottles up ahead. What the hell was that? Probably just a stray dog. No, no, uh, it was bigger than that. It looked like a, a weird monkey dog thing. Wretch, shoot it! Hey, that's it! That's the monkey dog thing I saw! You hit him? Don't think so. Looks like he got away. You ever seen that before? Yeah, but they usually travel in packs. All right. Stay alert and use cover. The other ones are probably around here somewhere. Hey. Nice mantle, Rook. Not an easy maneuver to make in full gear. Nothing here. Maybe they're in the alley. Let's check it out. Grab a few of those grenades. I got a feeling we're gonna need them. Damn, someone needs to do an ammo sweep around here. Wretch! What'd you call that thing, a monkey dog? <laughs> I got a special bone for it. Needs a few stitches. It can wait. Pull that shit again, Rook, and you're gonna get some unexpected chainsaw training. Let's get in there. Fire up your lancers, Delta. Almost looks peaceful from up here. Almost. Whoa! All this damage came from your grenade? Sure as hell didn't come from yours. Nothing up here. Just some rats. <clears throat> Let's head back to the hospital.
check it. Vacation's over, kid. Head back to the convoy drop-off. Stay there till I call you on your TACCOM. But... That's an order, soldier! Dom, let's move. Still here? Still here, Marcus. Tell Dom I may have a lead on his flight, but it doesn't look Anya, what'd you find? A lead on a Django. It doesn't look like she... I'll fill you in later, Dom. I have to get back to control. All right, Anya. Good luck. Damn it! Kill these goddamn grubs. Let's move! to see you. What are we looking at? Locust Reed. Follow me. Locust got some serious sacks coming in here like this. Doubt it has anything to do with courage. They just don't realize they've been sent on a suicide run. Maybe they're just desperate. What do you mean? Maybe the light mass bomb hit them harder than we thought. Or maybe something else is going down in the hollow. I don't know. Heads up, Delta. Some of these patients have rust lung. Okay, take position along these windows. I take the far side. Okay, Delta, I'm back online. We have confirmed Locust presence in the hospital. I repeat, Locusts are in the hospital. Yeah, well now we've got a power outage too. I'm on it. I'll keep you posted. Control out. Hold fire till they're right below us. We want to get as many of them in the courtyard as we can. Most of those supplies are actually fuel tanks, Delta. Part of the ambush. Here they come. Get ready. Control! Where's the power? Almost there, Delta. Got it. Door should be open now. Thanks, Control. Delta out. What'd you say these guys got? Rust lung. Motion sickness. 
Cases have been popping up all over since the light mass bombing. There's a horrible way for a warrior to die. Uh, contagious? They say it's not, but I'd keep my distance. No argument here.
Delta. Locusts are outside of the hospital taking position in the streets, requesting assistance. Roger, Control. We're on it. This is Centaur 2-3, establishing position outside of the hospital. door. Yes. <laughs> 
like the glow of locust blood in this light. You got a sick mind, Ty. What are you doing here, Rook? Area I was guarding got too hot, Sergeant. These gears rounded me up to fight, sir. So why aren't you out there fighting? Well, reloading, sir. I still don't have that trick down. Better learn fast. Let's get out there, Delta. Contact! Grab some cover. We gotta dig in before we can get down there. Rook, with us. Let's move. seen the locusts run like this. Running away won't help! I'll just shoot you in your asses! You are pissed today. Damn right. I missed my family. I'll kill every one of these bastards. Nice work, Delta. And Rook. 
Carmine. You did good. Well, thanks, Sergeant Phoenix. Control, this is Delta. Enemy threat eliminated. Over. Copy that, Delta. Everything okay on your end? Yeah, it was close, but I got out in time. What'd you find? I... Tell me, Anya. Don't bullshit me. The Jane Doe I mentioned? She fits the description, but... Well, looks like she was released a few days ago. We don't have any info after that. There's gotta be another lead, or... or something, right? I'm sorry, Dom. That's it. I'm sorry. Damn it! Not again! I've lost her again! Ah! God damn it! Copy that, Anya. Delta out. Dom, you okay? Just... I'll catch up with you in a sec, Marcus. All right? Yeah. Whatever you need. Guys, let's go. Humans are no strangers to war. After all, we've been fighting for as long as we can remember. War is all we know. In the past, we fought for emulsion. We fought for country. We fought for freedom. But all that changed after E-Day. For 15 years, We've been fighting for our very survival against inhuman, genocidal monsters. But it is a fight. We cannot continue. Humanity faces extinction unless we end this war now. So why land down, Sergeant? Why not just drill down here? Jacinto's the one place it can't dig through, and land down's a perfect spot to hit him on their own turf. Heard there's a shitload of grubs there, Sergeant. More like ten shitloads. We had hoped the light mass bombing would decimate the Locust Horde. But they survived, and have returned stronger than ever. They've brought with them a force that can sink entire cities. Even Jacinto, our last beacon of hope through all these dark days, is now at risk. Soon we'll have nothing left to defend. And that means we have only one option. Attack. What I ask of you now is not an easy thing, but it is necessary. If we are to survive, if we are to live long enough to see the seasons pass, our children grow and experience a time of peace that we have never known, we must now take this fight to the Locust. We will go to where they live, and where they breed, and we will destroy them! This is the day we take the battle to the heart of the enemy. This is the day that we correct the course of human history! This is the day we ensure our survival and the species! of the cog, my fellow gears, go forth and bring back the hope of humanity! Boy, welcome to the big sock, Sergeant Phoenix. 
You ready to hit the road? You know it. Well, let's go chunk some bullets at them grunts. One thing I still don't understand, have the locusts been down for like forever for what? Man. This one guy in basic, he thought they were from Risea or one of the moons, and that they feed on emulsion. Hey Marcus, you ever seen them eating? They can eat shit and die for all I can. Guys, what am I hearing? Down here, something else to shoot. Good to go. I think it's safe to say that's not a natural cave formation. You were wondering where they come from, Carmine? Oh. You what? <laughs> Come <laughs> on. 
Roger. Jack, scan these bodies. Looks like there's some kind of market. Okay, let's move out. Anyone who's there. This is horrible. Oh my god. If they sunk Tolan, Montevado, and now Elima, and they all surround Jacinto. Shit, they're punching holes around Jacinto to sink it. This is KR-54. I'm hit. I Control, KR-5 is down in the Elima sinkhole. We're en route. Over. Roger, Delta. Alima was evacuated, but keep an eye out for surviving stranded just in case. Wilco, Delta out. Let's get over to that chopper, All right, Delta! Another building coming down!
Coming! Back there! Lucas, they're killing everyone back there! Watch your fire around the civilians! Barriers! 